Hi there, Amit here for Advices Media and this is the Sony Xperia Z2 Android smartphone which comes bundled up with this uh, smart band which is a fitness tracker and this is exclusively available in India wherein this band is actually bundled up in the retail unit for free of cost and uh, this would actually track your steps and uh, do a little more than just tracking steps by sending you notifications and uh, even alerting you when your uh, phone is not near to you so kind of uh, pretty interesting band i'll be showing you all the features in our upcoming videos but in this video i'll be showing you how you could set up this unit the moment you purchase it since you're not purchased a retail unit of this band you don't get a lot of uh, information around the same and uh, the first thing what you have to do is go to the smartphone there's xperia z2 which you actually purchased and uh, under the application drawer you just have to search for the application which comes pre-installed by default there's no app available you won't find any application available for the smart band which actually has to be the life log application so you need to first go to the bluetooth and uh, here you need to sync this device with the band and uh, it will take a few seconds to sync up which will uh, show you the name as SWR10 following this the next step is that you would actually be shown with the option wherein uh, you would have to actually download two applications let me show you a few screen captures which i had done while uh, completing this procedure because you need to go through the right steps to complete this uh, process and then uh, get the photo get the whole installation done so once you are done with the option of uh, setting up the Bluetooth you will be actually asked to download two applications the smart band app and the lifelog application both of these are very important first of the smart band band and the lifelog application are available through the play store you need to download that once you do that you will find that both of these are set up and then uh, since it's first time being uh, used you would find that uh, it would uh, update the firmware of this unit once it's done you are ready to go you would be asked to set up the life log application and then you are taken to the app so once you have synced up everything and then you are ready to go you would uh, find the life log application which is this on your device do ensure that you have set up the time and date perfectly on your unit and then you are ready to go now here as you can see the first thing what you see here is the total calories the total steps you have taken on a day the total pictures captured and you can beautifully check all these things by just playing the option on the stop which would actually make it uh, play in the form of a beautiful movie since we were using this uh, phone today on the desk and uh, not actually doing a lot of activities around the same and still i have not started using this as my primary phone because i have not yet synced my contacts and moved my sim card so you won't find all these activities but if you actually watch a few movies or play some music if you are sleeping or if you have bookmarked something then all those data, data would be actually stored onto this life log application and then it would be shown to you as you can see here i have set up my total goal for the steps in a day at 6000 and uh, these are the statistics for the same i personally think that the numbers which it shows here is pretty low when compared to what i had earlier seen on the fitbit which is my primarily uh, tracker for tracking the steps so i'll be comparing both of the steps from tomorrow by comparing the steps by using the fitbit and uh, the sony smart band and also i'll be comparing it with the gear fit along with the gear 2 so a lot of fitness uh, accessories here we'll be comparing all of these in terms of the pedometer feature and then uh, showing it to you in this video i just wanted to show you our convey message on how you could actually set up the sony smart band you can check out the link in the description below that's uh, on our blog, blog that is the variable stuff.com where you can find more uh, information around the sony smart band that's it for now i'll be uploading the sony xperia z2's uh, benchmark videos and the gaming playback uh, performance videos in the coming days so don't forget to add a thumbs up and let let me know in the comment section if you have any queries around this device. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.